See? It was bad? What? You could have watched probably. I turned around, y'all were huddled up, no one was watching, y'all were talking to each other. I'm gonna run stadium. The one time. The one time. You, you can sit right here and watch it. Alright. And then see, see you're like you're like, you're like look, you're like my little like my little kid. As soon as you get something, you don't want it no yeah, more. Yeah, yeah. See what I mean? What do we miss? I can't take it. Good practice though? Yeah, well. I like it. Because now not only us twice now, how many rain delays do you get during the season? Last year we had three of them. We had to start, go back in. Sit down. Now, these are long, but you may have to do it for two hours. And then you prepare, and they come back out. Attitude was good. Was practice perfect? No. But the work ethic and the energy level and the, and the mental set, mindset, was very good. I like it. It's a little bit frustrating, though. You can't get that two and a half straight hours oh, in. I yeah. Mean, I mean, you need it. But, I mean, that's Florida. Right. And you can't practice in the morning because you got class. You can't practice at 6.30 because you ain't got lights on but one field in the practice field. Right. So, you can't do it. You're, you're, you're stuck. You got to You're... We're at the beckoning call of weather, but we'll adapt and do what we got to do. There ain't no excuses. We got to play ball. A good idea would be an indoor practice facility. I think. I want one. You don't? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm like a little kid. I said I don't want. But but I'm gonna tell you what though. There is some good work coming out of this. But having to delay for those rain delays, which are having to get a lot. Of. There's a little method to the madness that happens. Dan Hicks had a good scrimmage. Is he following up on that still? Doing yeah, it's still getting better. Dan's getting better. Got to learn to be more consistent, but he's learning to do it, come off the ball every time because he, he's got a great athleticism. To learn to burst and then respect, make people respect that speed and athleticism and then work his moves off of him. Sometimes he thinks too much on his moves, and that's just youth. You know what I'm saying? But he's getting better. Being obviously a Florida State fan growing up, what do you remember of Dan Clinton? <laughs> a man. <laughs> a man that could play the run, the pass, and do about what he wanted to do. His athletic could really run for a big guy. And that's why he had a great career and, and, and did it off a big time knee injury. Yeah. I mean, overcoming and broke the sidebacks record and all the things that come with that. I mean, uh, that was a big time deal. And, uh, and his son's got a lot of ability too. Talk a little bit about Greg as a defender now. You know, last year he made the splash as the return man, but you're counting on him. Being a yeah, he makes plays, year. balls in the air, very instinctive, uses his eyes well, makes a lot of plays and covers up for a lot of plays. He, you know, guys will get beat, he'll overlap it now. And, the good thing I like what he's been doing pretty much is not giving up plays and still making plays, and that's hard to do. You know what I mean? That, that's very hard to do when you're starting to get pretty good and uh, guys doing a good job. You uh, still copying as Spurlock like out here tomorrow? Uh, yeah, what the plans are. He was running and did everything and worked out. It seemed good, so that's the plan, unless they tell me something different in the morning. But as of right now, I'm playing on one. Dako's done a good job since he's been out here. Okay. When do you think you get Moody back in full time? I don't know. I, I guess we'll have to wait and see on that. I mean, I, I, I'm expecting by this weekend. Or anybody you're thinking might not be available for Sanford? Snyder. I mean, I mean Snyder and the three guys there. No, I, I think everybody else is about to plan and what they're telling me should be should be ready to play. But you got to remember, they ain't ready to play, it's ready to practice. Been a big push on ticket sales for the Sanford game as of late. How important is it going to be to have the stadium full? I think it's huge. I mean, why, why, would, you, why would you not come and, and pack it out and, and, and see these kids, what they've done in the offseason, and, and support them? If you're a, I mean, Florida State fan, that's, that's what you do. You support your people. That's family. Family supports no matter what's going on. And I think we got a great family here. And I know our team is. And uh, we'd love to see that those fans in the stands and everything going well. Do you, do you notice any kind of change in the guys maybe the first couple of days of the classes start? As they, you know, is, it, is it an adjustment for them as they balance practice and, and academics? I think so. I hear a lot more girl, girl stories. I'm talking about girl a little now. <laughs> no, they've been pretty good. But they, 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 they really hadn't missed. I mean, they've come in and did their work and doing what they're supposed to be. Doing what they're supposed to be. How much? Uh, how much? Improvement have you seen in that mental aspect of it? since like Wednesday of last or Tuesday or Wednesday of last week? It seemed like the, the switch went on. And it has. They're starting to get ready for game, and they understand that every practice they got to do something to get better because it's time. You know, football players usually have a switch about two weeks before they play. Most of them, even in the NFL, you look at them, those older guys. You know, what I mean, they know they got to get ready. No matter how much you you're trying to endure and get through, and, and but they're, 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 there's a switch that I got to do things right because I'm gonna be on that field and take advantage of opportunities. They seem to be doing it. We're nowhere close. We're, we're, I mean, guys, we got a lot of work to do. I mean, a lot of work. But I've seen some improvements the last couple of days. Is that reflected in some of your comments to them when you see mistakes? Are you more fine tuning the little things instead we are. of correcting it, the bigger it's things? Not mass, it's not mass missed assignment. It's I, the, the technique and detail. See, that's what effort isn't enough. We, we play with a lot of effort, but it's effort with execution. Effort. When you're tired, when you're hurt, it doesn't matter. And when I'm trying and I'm giving effort, well, guess what? If it ain't getting it done, you're not doing it right. You might as well not be doing it. 
And that's what you got to learn, and that's mental toughness and mental condition. It ain't no different than anybody else in the country, though. So is the schedule to eat now? Like, how does the, how does all the rain affect all this? They move it back. Just we pushes it back a couple hours, I yeah, guess. Push it back. Though. They eat some snack bars, you know, those power bars and those things in between. Get a little snack, keep their energy up, and then they go eat.